Lord! Over here! I found something. You must see this! Come on, man! Odd-looking things, aren't they? Old and weathered. Is this what they call Mayan? Or is it Aztec? Are you good with riddles, Edward? Puzzles and ponderings and the like. No worse than the next man, why? I think you've a natural gift for it. The way you think and work. The way you understand the world. Well, I don't know about that. You're talking in riddles now and I don't understand a word. Clamber on top of this thing here, will you? Help me solve something. Concentrate and focus all your senses. Look past shadow and sound, deep into matter, until you see and hear a kind of shimmering. A shimmering? You understand? I think so. I've seen its like before, glowing. Ah, right, I know this feeling. I have since I was a lad. It's like using every sense at once, isn't it? To see sounds and hear shapes. Quite a combination. Every man and woman on this earth has in them a kind of intuition hidden deep in earth. You are a gifted man, Edward. Has a strange look. Is it worth something? Nothing you can spend. But if you find all of them, it'll lead to something grand. How many? A few dozen, I think. This way. I have something else to show you. something else just here. I think you'll take to this secret much faster. Now this has the makings of a mystery. It's good, isn't it? Only wait till you see what lies at the end. Here we are. What do you think? I think Monsieur de Casse was a man of many secrets. Aye, and look here. A solid staircase leading God knows where. What do you suppose lies at the top? From what I knew of de Casse, I wouldn't be surprised to find eclectic instruments of torture and villainy. An Iron Maiden or a collection of thumbscrews. Or a pair of anguish. <laughs> Not a nice way to kick off. But that is some damn fine gear. Try the key you took from Ducasse. That's one. Only four left. Aye. It might be that these four Templars have them. See the names here? They've been sent to kill these four targets. Hang me, that's the map I sold to Governor Torres in Havana. He said it marked the location of assassin encampments. You think maybe you owe them a bit of warning, then? If you have any kind of heart beating in that chest. Suppose I could. If it leads me to the four other keys. Bad excuse is better than none at all.
Leaving already. I think this cove suits you best, Edward. Better than that costume does. Oh, come on now. We're pirates, kid. We take as we please and become who we like. Self-made man. But that look ain't you. It's not who you are. Who am I, then? Hard to tell some days. All I know is you like dangerous prizes. Like the observatory? I think you know more about that than you let on in NASA. You noticed that, did you? Meet me at 20 degrees, three minutes latitude just off the coast of Yucatan. I'll have something to show you there in a few weeks' time. Captain, we found a trove of nautical maps and ledgers and the like, scattered about the village. You'll find them sorted in the captain's quarters of the Jackdaw. Quality stuff. Nautical maps and ledgers? Might come in useful if we decide to build up a fleet of our... day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'll be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Ade. <laughs> and what's your aim? Master Kidd hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down in Tulum. Quite some distance, mind, on the Yakutan Peninsula. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way of picking away at my conscience that gives me pause. I should go see him soon. So long as we take some prizes along the way, I'm sure the crew will understand. I'll set a course for Tulum.
As much strain as you can! Shorten sail! Get off the squall! Call down and clue up! Look up! Off the gallants and royal! Get them in! Today, Captain, it's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to here. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'd be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Addy. <laughs> Master Kidd hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down in Toulon. Quite some distance, mind, on the Yakutan Peninsula. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way of picking away at my conscience that gives me pause. I should go see him soon. So long as we take some prizes along the way, I'm sure the crew will understand. I'll set a course for Tulum. And if we drown while we are young, we'll be It's better to drown than to wait to be hung. There he goes! Oh, growl ye may, but go ye must. Maybe Susie and I. If you growl too hard, your head they'll bust. We're all down over the mountain. Up socks, you cocks, and her two blocks. Maybe Susie and I. And go below to your old ditty box. Go down over the mountain. Oh, rock and shake uh, one more drag. Baby Susie and I. Oh, bend your dust and pack your bag. Oh, he's a stick! Get the hit! 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 Get the h